today we get a taste of the South here at Black Dog Kitchen where the owner is combining his love for his dog, his favorite band, and community. All right, I'll give you a hint on his favorite band. His dog's name is Zeppelin. And I'm here with Ben Harvey, the owner of Black Dog Kitchen. So excited to chat with you and to taste the food, of course. So let's talk about how you started. How I started, well, it's been a, a long time dream come true. Um, I, I lost a family member that left me a little gift and mm -hmm. I just, you know, I've always thought that, you know, if luck equals opportunity plus skill, then this was my opportunity. Mm -hmm. So here I am and I've gotten pretty lucky so far. So. Oh. Love it. Turning something maybe negative into something positive, Absolutely. right? To carry Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. And and the food. Now you're talking southern. Uh, let's let's throw out some of the things on the menu. Uh, some collard greens. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got you know grits of course. Our mm -hmm. muffaletta, black and catfish po' boy, fried mm -hmm. green tomatoes with the homemade pimento cheese, which was her recipe. Oh. So you know it's always coming back home. Yes. Okay. I love that. So what brought you to San Antonio? Uh, post Katrina, mm -hmm. uh, had my dad was living here, okay. and I knew I always wanted to come back home. So okay. you know, here I am, and I, I loved it. The culture, um, the city itself, it mm -hmm. was just it was home, and I knew it was home. I met my wife here. My son was born oh. here, so yeah. it's my home. Got it. Okay, and then you start. You said you started in restaurants in Mississippi. Right? I did. I started cooking when I was about 16 and okay. just have done a little bit of everything since. So okay. I just like doing it. I like the community aspect of it, being around people and seeing smiles on people's faces. So okay. that's what that's, that's what makes me do it. Sounds like a perfect job. All right. And you got your dog. <laughs> and right I got here. my dog. He's oh, always with that. me. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and um, shall we sample some of the menu items? Now? Absolutely. Let's do it. Sounds good. So what are we starting with first, Ben? We're going to start with the muffaletta. Okay. It's a New Orleans specialty sandwich. Oh my goodness. Look Comes this. served on a nine inch round sesame bread mm -hmm. with ham, salami, and uh, olive relish. And I think our olive relish is what sets mine apart and makes it as authentic as it can be. Next we have our boudin balls Ooh. with our homemade comeback dressing and our homemade collard greens. Okay, of course. what are boudin balls boudin for those balls. who don't know? Boudin <laughs> balls are basically a, uh, it's a pork and rice blended sausage. Okay. So no beef um, and then we basically take them and deep fry them. Um, and they're delicious. I mean, deep fried, all of that. Anything I'm sure deep fried. The spices, right? The seasoning is that what helps make it have that pop of flavor? Absolutely. Okay, and then obviously we've got to have our greens. Our greens. Okay. Slow simmered for three to four hours. Delicious. And last, we've got our Ooh. take on the New Orleans barbecue shrimp mm -hmm. and our mock show, which is actually our Cajun cream corn. Okay. So there's bacon and Trinity. And then I've got a blend of seasonings for vegetables, and then we add a little heavy cream to it right there at the end. And our barbecue shrimp has become very popular very fast. Wow. It is a Worcestershire butter mix with another blend of seasonings that mm -hmm. we cook to order. Um, so it's a homemade sauce to order every time, and it's amazing. And that bread looks really good, too. The bread is that traditional. That makes a difference, right? Yes, absolutely. Got to right. have the real stuff. OK, here's a final look. One more time at the delicious food. We're keeping these flies away. Flies but yes, away. Again, it looks amazing. Thank you so much, Chef Ben. Now, again, I've never tried a food and ball, so here we go. You're in for a treat. Okay. There we go. Tell us one more time what's in this. It's got pork and rice sausage, mm. then deep fried, and all kinds of seasonings. They're so flavorful and delicious. Thank you. Okay, and this is Zeppelin. We had to show you. We had to meet Zeppelin. <laughs> Who is your dog? He's a that's, wild that's one. That's on the truck. Thank you guys so much, Ben and Zeppelin, Thank you. for having me out for the delicious food. Again, a true taste of the South Cajun deliciousness. If you want to check them out, you can just follow them on their social media so you can keep up with the different locations, right, Ben? Because you travel different spots. Absolutely. All the time. Blackdogkitchen.net. I have a calendar on there at all times. All right. Thank you, Zeppelin, for the hospitality. You should. You're welcome. Thank you so much. <laughs> For more information, SALive.com, click the As Seen on SA Live tab or scan the QR code on your screen. I think he wants a walk now. I think he wants okay. a walk now. Okay. I teased him. Celebrate San Antonio with us on YouTube. Yeah, all of your favorite DIY videos, food, drinks, tips, and tricks. If you've seen it here, it's on the SA Live YouTube channel. Just search KSAT SA Live on YouTube and like, subscribe, and ring the bell.